One country's pest is another's delicacy. The long-spined sea urchin has eaten its way along Tasmania's east coast, but now it's being harvested in rapidly growing numbers to satisfy appetites in Asia. The long-spined sea urchin invaded Tasmanian waters 30 years ago. Their voracious appetite has destroyed the habitat of abalonian rock lobsters. But now the tables have been turned. A Tasmanian company is about to start exporting the pest to Asia as a seafood delicacy. Our demand's huge. They started selling the urchin domestically 18 months ago. From a harvest of one tonne a week, they're now collecting three tonnes a week and the numbers are set to explode. We'll move into exporting our product now and hopefully that'll see production you know, double or triple in the next sort of between now and Christmas. The long spines make processing tricky, but cracking the shell is worth it. The urchin row can fetch up to $110 a kilogram. The gold rush, you know, because uh, normally uh, we have the experience and uh, 10 years ago Tasmania shiach is no good. But this time the David process is good, very nice. There's also an environmental benefit. Kelp beds stripped bare along parts of the northeast coast are showing signs of recovery. You can definitely see, you know, seaweed regrowth and, you know, the habitat returning to its, you know, former states. In one respect, we're developing an industry, a new industry, and uh, with a, a very positive spin-off of benefit for the marine environment. The first export of long-spined sea urchins is expected within weeks. Damien McIntyre, ABC News, Goshen.